Sorry, I just farted. Hold on. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. Welcome back to another video. I can't believe that this is the first time that I'm speaking to you guys because I've had a morning. Got my matcha already. I got my wax, eyebrows done, lip done, coochie done. But done. That was hurting a little bit too. So welcome back, you guys. We are doing another de appointment routine. Bay is coming back into town. He was only gone for a week, but things are about to get spicy tonight because we didn't get to do anything fun, you know what I'm saying, before he left. I just pulled up to Sephora. I didn't even know there was a Sephora over here. I was just gonna go to uh, Target. I might still go to Target if they don't have what I need in here, but I'm looking to get some lashes, maybe a new fragrance. I don't know, I'm feeling crazy. It's still early in the day. He doesn't come until six. Um, so I have to pick him up at the airport at 6 and it's 10.30, so. Hey. Truck to the plane, to the truck. Truck to the hotel lobby. Me, I go through underground garages. Presidential suites on the closet. Elevator up to the room. Shower up and then we hit the club. I'm very unwell. I don't know who the I was spending $200 in there. I went in for lashes, but they just, everything, every time I turned the corner, I was seeing stuff that I wanted. So, Fenty Skin Exfoliating Body Scrub. I got a Summer Fridays Lip Balm. I wanted a specific one for my purse, so I got this one. It's the vanilla one. Grande Lash, just a little one because I want to grow out my lashes. I've been wanting to try this Sol de Janeiro deodorant so i got that honey infused hair oil and i heard really good things about this some lashes of course it's house of lashes in the iconic iconic light i don't know they look cute on the picture moroccan dry body oil this smells so good i love it i got like a sample size and i was obsessed with it so i just wanted to buy the full one this ilia skin skin tint got spf uh, niacinamide, hyaluronic acid. I'm really, really excited to try it. But, anyways, y'all, got my nails done. Can you see they're like red zebra? So cute. I'm trying something different with the shape. Did like an almond shape, and I don't hate it. For having like chubby fingers, I actually don't hate it. I thought that coffin shape was the only thing that flattered my fingers, but these are bad for how short they are and you know, the round shape almond shape or round whatever it is actually they look pretty good toes hold on let me show you guys my toes because i shaved my toes last night too look at these dogs bitch look at how suckable these look usually not a fan of red but he was like next time you get your nails done i think you should do red so i got it red hopefully he remembers that he said that because i baby i listen okay <laughs> Upstairs neighbor activity. She doesn't know how to play fetch. She just goes and she puts it in her mouth and she comes back. Oh, idiot, I love you. I love you, Greeny. The day that these dogs are not here anymore. <sighs> do y'all ever think about that with your pet? All the Greenies around the world say this is what Greenies do. Anything these Greenies want, I got it just for you. Greenies, Greenies. <laughs> Greenies, Greenies. Yay! We're back home and I always, in every single one of these videos, I give you some sort of snack. Nothing having to do with food to eat prior to your de appointment or pussy appointment. This is called de appointment, but this could be for any appointment. You know what I'm saying? Y'all are about to be real mad at me. My snack today. What is that? It's gonna be a green juice. <laughs> Nothing can really make you taste better down there unless you want to take fenugreek, which I've talked about before. It'll just make your sweat sweet. Any liquid coming from your body will make you taste sweet. I don't really take those anymore because fenugreek for me is like more of like a hookup situation. He's gonna eat it regardless. You know what I'm saying? So to me, I don't need to take that, but always give that tip. Make sure you read up on it before you take it. I don't want to like 
tell anybody to take anything that's not right for them or their body or their hormones or you know anything like that i would either talk to a doctor or do your own research on that i just like to give out you know you know i love to give out my little tips but in the last video i was talking about how important vitamins are specifically vitamin b to make a woman reach her point this has tons and tons of vitamins in it i'm just gonna drink half of it because i think only have half left drink up baby <laughs> okay if you're a vegan i know that your tastes good okay, another tip i'm gonna give actually on that topic don't eat like burger or beef 24 hours before like if you know you're gonna go to an appointment and you don't want to taste funky down there do not eat beef 24 hours before i don't know what it is about beef but it'll make you taste stank for like 24 hours i'm not sure why that is maybe some people's bodies is different but just to throw that out there that might not happen for you but i know personally anyways so let's drink up i got the naked green machine i actually like the taste of this it's like one of the only green juices i'll drink and it has no like added sugars it's got broccoli spinach wheatgrass ginger root talked about this in the last video but if you guys didn't see it i'm about to just say it quickly here again the loving libido these this work i know a lot of people said that they had to continually keep taking this for them to notice any type of difference for people who want to be sexual but just have no sexual drive like that was me for a really long time i was like am i depressed i'm not really sure what's going on I just had no sex like literally nothing could turn me on i was turned off by everything everything gave me the ick i'm just gonna take one of these i think the serving size is two should i take two it doesn't matter anyways y'all because i've been more neat ew i hope my mom doesn't watch this before we get into the rest of the routine the shower routine first we got to talk about Semper because they are sponsoring today's video we are so excited about it because i got some good new perfumes i don't know what Semper is a subscription service for perfume not just any perfume y'all they got luxury perfumes i love the packaging of these y'all know i love a good travel to go perfume i love things that are so easy to just throw in your bag the ones i picked up this month is prada candy which i love my favorite new set to wear to the gym actually i have delina exclusive y'all need to smell this this is giving someone actually commented to my last video and they were like it's giving that girl no it is no it is this smells so good that's my favorite thing about semper because you can try the perfume before you go out and spend you know 300 dollars. i don't know if you're someone like me but there's some sense that i just get over extremely fast and this could be enough for me i can have this size of a perfume and i don't have to spend that 300 dollars because i got it for so much cheaper and then i'm kind of over it or if i'm obsessed with the perfume and i want to go ahead and buy it then i know hey i'm obsessed with this perfume i have to have it i have to have the big bottle and i can go ahead and do that this month i got delina exclusive product candy which i already told y'all about also got malibu nights which i love kind of smells like ariana grande cloud also got the christian serrano midnight silhouette oh yes hold on i'm gonna spray it right now even though i'm about to take a shower so if y'all want to get 55 percent off your first month on semper it's only eight dollars make sure y'all check that out everything will be in the description below also paste my code here on the screen but thank you to semper for sponsoring this video and let's get into the shower routine i think i'm crazy hey i've been craving it's i put it quite plainly
shower now in my robe robe from target we're gonna floss because my gums i definitely think when my got my wisdom teeth removed something happened to my gums how exciting is it to smell it seeing these grin double i don't know y'all the packaging got me also have these too but usually i only take these if i'm like gonna travel because they're disposable tongue cleaners like, yeah, I'm sold, okay? If you're not a regular flosser, y'all, it's gonna stink in there. It's gonna smell like a fart poo spray. It's so weird not being able to feel this whole side of your face or teeth or gums or anything. Cause when I'm flossing, I'm really like getting in there. It's in there like a thong, bitch. I made my gums bleed the other day because I was going so crazy cause I thought it wasn't in there. It was a massacre. I've been really good about flossing. I do it like, almost every single day now, which is crazy because I've always been like into my teeth, but never into flossing. I'm gonna do mouthwash. This Henny Listerine bottle, look, this is ginormous. We use this every day. Like what? Both of us, it just doesn't ever seem to go down. And I refuse to buy another mouthwash until this starts to, you know, go down, but it just never looks like it is, so. Cheers, y'all. Instead of doing a regular mouthwash, Get one of these. I don't know if they sell them on Amazon. Take the little syringe and I just shoot it back there and it's gonna get all the encrusted like food and gunk. This is like my new favorite way to do mouthwash. Cause you're still gonna swish it in your mouth, but you're gonna. Mm. I would show you guys, but I feel like it's so nasty. And then watch all the little particles of food come out. Ugh, if you're like me and food gets stuck in your back teeth, this is such a good way to do mouthwash. I know it's like kind of extra and you know, nobody wants to really do that with their mouthwash, but I'm telling you, it gets back there. It does a thorough job. All that food bacteria, ooh, that's the reason why it smells like ass shit. I seen a prank the other day. I really want to do this on him and my mom. So I hope they don't watch this video, but <laughs> I seen someone spray fart spray in someone's hand as hand sanitizer. I literally have never laughed so hard in my life. The guy was like, here, you want some hand sanitizer? And the guy puts his hands out and he's like, smell it, it smells really good. Y'all, I wanna do it so freaking bad. Like, oh my God, I was already looking up fart sprays on Amazon. No, I have to do this. It was so funny. Cut my hair with my Tangle Teaser. Best brush ever. I think I've used it in every single one of these videos. The only thing I'm putting for like skincare is the Coco Kine Ceramide Barrier Serum. Can you see that? Amazing. The barrier between your skin and pollution. I just like to use this as a barrier for my skin because I don't wear foundation anymore. I feel like I say that in every video. Like, bitch, you don't get a cookie for not wearing foundation. <laughs> and now, this morning I come inside, there's literal poo stains on the comforter. I thought it was dirt. No, it's poo stains. Sadie so left fucking stains on my bed. She's looking at me like, me, mama? Yeah. Yeah, you little shit stain. Let's put the Sol de Janeiro deodorant on. This is the one I got today. It smells delightful and delectable and delicious. The three Ds. Just love anything that's their scent. The bomb bomb cream. I'm gonna put some fur oil on my cooter cat. Y'all, last time I didn't put this oil on and you don't even wanna know. I was like hurting in pain from ingrowns for like a week. It was so painful, so. I know that this girl's gonna get me right every single time. The fur oil, it is so good. I actually wanna try some of their other products because I know that they make some other stuff. It's not just ingrown oil. So let me know if you guys have tried any of their other products and let me know what's good. Then I'm gonna go in with some Vaseline Deep Moisture Jelly. How long have I had my wisdom teeth removed? Has it been two weeks? You're not supposed to suck anything for two weeks. Imagine I get lockjaw. <laughs> I would literally die. No, I would pass away. Cause I'm not really supposed to be doing stuff with my mouth. Like even eating stuff is like too much. First I'm gonna put on the Vaseline. We're gonna do with the dry body oil. It just sprays. See how it's like, wait, let me show you. See? And this smells really good. We're gonna try the hair oil, the honey infused hair oil. 
this really is like me trying a whole bunch of new products oh okay it does smell good it smells like exactly what i thought it would smell like like a old baby doll head <laughs> do you know do you know the smell i'm talking about see y'all probably in a couple of hours let's see what time it is it's three o'clock i'm gonna see y'all once my hair dries honestly and some hours later my hair is almost all the way dry but i thought that we would do some makeup just a little bit nothing crazy just lashes and like a little bit of face i'm gonna sweat it all off so there's literally no point milk hydro grip primer sicapair tiger grass color correcting treatment right here where i got my wax it's red it's really red so i'm just gonna put that all right here even some spots right here where i have some scarring so i take a little eyebrow brush and i put the primer because it's like sticky and i put that on here and i just go like this i don't know where mine got to be jealous so i just started using this and i'm like whatever i don't even care to find my gel because this works just as good just like to like make them a little bit bigger than they are my eyebrows are really skinny and they're really close to my eyeball like really close no lid space so fuck you big lidded bitches i will always be jealous of you try this out we'll see you know how it lasts what it does what it's giving i got the four color four it's st4 online it looked like that i would be between six and seven and then when i got in the store i was like six and seven <laughs> miss ma'am you are white i don't know if i want to put it in with a brush or my fingers feels nice smells like play-doh i definitely feel like this will give off a dewy look which i really like is it giving glow batty this is the nars soft matte concealer i'm just gonna put it right here using my fenty matchstick in amber this is like my best shade to be honest well i think it's my best shade because i've tried so many cream bronzers and they just never worked for me so use rare beauty blush this is in the shade joy it's really coral so i'm just gonna do like two one on the nose just like that perfect love these blushes she's like two different types of blushes and they're both really good this one is a lot more pigmented than the other ones a little bit of highlight this is the rare beauty highlight the liquid i like this because it's very subtle like if you're just wanting a little highlight do it under my brow too all right let's put these lashes on okay i got my lashes on finally and they just i don't feel like they give like, i could have worn mascara and got this similar a similar result i just think they're not dramatic enough for me they're still cute though they definitely give natural vibes which is nice which is what i was going for anyway so nyx pencil in nude truffle let's see if i can do it from the mirror from here oh my god i can't feel this side of my face this is summer friday's gloss or lip balm or whatever it's called i don't know it looks so good this is definitely gonna be my new purse lip balm because it's like so aesthetic too like literally on top of it just for like a little shimmer i'm gonna put this mac dazzle gloss called baby sparks and i just want like a little shimmer so i'm gonna wear that green outfit that i was wearing today because i haven't worn that in a while and this lady complimented me when i was coming out of my wax she was like that outfit is so cute and i was like ah oh, thank you it is isn't it I didn't say that, but in my head, I'm like, this is a cute outfit. So I think it's gonna be my little outfit, airport fit. I have given up picking out lingerie and cute fits because he doesn't even care. Like, he doesn't even look at it. I think for the hair, I wanna do something like fun. Little ponytails coming out the top. I think that would be cute. And then I'm gonna straighten the ends to like bump them. His favorite hair on me is like when it's a little bit wavy, but I'm like, mm -mm, too bad. I already gave you the red nails. You can't have everything. <laughs> they look cute? Yay! I love it. It looks really cute. I'm glad I did the two little ponies. These little gold 
hoops because they match the rings that I'm gonna wear. My rings are from Amazon. These rings are so fire. I think they were like 25, maybe $30 each. They're so far and you can stack them. You can like stack them however many you want. And so they're thick. Oh, they're so good. I need to buy more actually. I've had them for years and they don't turn your finger green. They're so good. So I found a pair of underwear that I'm gonna wear because I think it's cute and it'll match. So it'll kind of look like a set. So it'll kind of be like lingerie, but not really. So I have these Savage Fenty. They're lace. Ooh, look at that. So yummy and delicious and cute. And I know that it'll make my ass look jiggly and good. I'm gonna just pair it with this black Savage Fenty bra. So it'll kind of look like a set, but it's not a set. You know, we're like finessing the system a little bit. I don't know if I'm allowed to show this or if it'll get demonetized, but can y'all see? It's just like lace. I'm going to use my Scentbird perfumes. I'm gonna use the Delina exclusive and I'm gonna mix it with the Midnight. And I'm gonna spray a little juicy because it's his favorite. He was literally on the game with his friends and he's like, yeah, tell your girl to get juicy. That's my favorite. It was really cute though. So I'm just gonna spray a little of that. Last thing we need to do is put the bed comforter on. My duvet cover is still in the dryer because I had to wash, I ended up washing the flat sheet in the duvet cover. I'll be able to like put the actual duvet cover on tonight, but at least we will have something clean to, you know, frolic on, I don't know. My dryer sheet, <laughs> there we go. Can't forget my blanket that I made. Like, look y'all, I made this shit. She looks fire. I love this blanket, obviously it's not perfect. It's got some problems, <laughs> but you know, good enough. Anyways, let me just hide this, there we go. The final part of the look, I couldn't let y'all hang in. I'm gonna wear my Gucci slides. So this is my fit, airport fit. It's so much fun hanging out with y'all. I love making these for y'all. They're so fun and so fun for me. So I love y'all and I cannot wait to see you in the next mothering video. Bye, y'all cool. See, I don't care that these bitches is all relatable. The shit I gave to you was unattainable. Look what you've done. Ruined everything we were becoming. I guess the only thing I couldn't do was keep you coming.